Good morning, everyone. It is uh, seven forty-five a.m. This is what we had. It came down, basically. It came up. Like, that's crazy. I'm gonna show you. This is our cabin. It's pretty nice. Uh, today we are heading to the Great Smoky Mountains Railroad, which I'm excited for being a rail fan, so... But if you guys want to see... Oh, that was the corn. Oh, it's from the bird seed. If you guys want to see that video, check out CSS Guide 2005. Uh, I decided to cheese Danish for breakfast. But... The GSMR stops, well, there's two routes. One goes across Lake Fontana, which is the one we're taking. And the other goes to Dillsboro, we're taking Lake Fontana one. And that stops at the Nantahala Outdoor Center, which you can walk, have lunch, look at the river, look at some outdoor stuff. So, yeah, I wonder what this door leads to. Oh, it's like, oh gosh, there's a roach. Okay. <laughs> I'm not going in there. Yeah, there's a fire pit. It's, it's not raining, it's like, I don't know, but this is kind of interesting. These weird pine trees. If you want to keep stop talking for a second and taking pictures. But yeah, there's some rose bush. There's other flowers. This is the Tuckasegee River. How far did we park? Hey, Mia. Where are we? Mia. Yeah, I think I'm, huh? I think I'm, I'm vlogging. We're going on a train ride. Yeah, there's the train. I just filmed the first thing from my train channel. There's another How diesel. Many people view your videos? On my vlogging channel? Yeah. I have 21 subscribers. 21. And it's clearing up, so I'm going to walk into the street and get run over. Well, I was walking in the dark to get on my bus. Well, don't fall in the plant. Oh, that little ugly pine tree. That's gas. Why are you that boy running? Oh, there's popcorn, Mia. Oh, that's what I smell. Oh, gosh. There's the depot. That's where the museum is down there. Oh yeah, I saw that. Look at that beauty right there! Oh wow. down the steam engines all the way down there and then we're in the almond car which is station number eight and there's some diesels pulling and there's some pretty trees I mean we're we're the last car yeah <laughs> the whistle is blow Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome aboard. So my name is Kevin. I'll be your show conductor today. A couple of nuts of housekeeping for you. <laughs> Please keep your body parts inside the car at all times. This includes cameras, cell phones, etc. 
Your closest restroom is located on the west end, that end of the Bryson City car. So forward two cars, all the way through. Lunch boxes, if you didn't <coughs> order them but forgot to pick them up at Depot, don't worry, we have them on the train for you. Sorry, there's a lot of chatter on the radio and I want to make sure I'm not missing anybody. <laughs> <laughs> Bathrooms, lunches, stay inside the cars. And one last thing is please try to keep the aisleways open and clear so the fellow passengers and staff can move about freely. Welcome aboard, we'll be rolling shortly. <laughs> Crossing the river now. Oh, oh that's scary. <laughs> the you cafe in your hand here in the conductor's cafe additionally you will not be able to purchase alcohol for other people each person who wishes to have an alcoholic beverage will need to be present with their id at time of purchase please drink responsibly this is a family oriented we have uh Beer, wine, wine, and we also have no. some mixed drinks. Some mixed drinks available. I've got a very small selection of mixed drinks inside the little car. Uh, I'm putting this so anyway, out. Look, here's what I'm going to do right now. I'll remind you, chicken biscuits, ham and cheese biscuits, and our butter biscuits, okay? All available for you right now. Everything. Do they buy the biscuits from Bojangles? So ladies and gentlemen, take your time coming down because I know we're going to be mine. But if you see us lined up, just take your time. It'll be a few minutes. We'll get you kicked out. And uh, kicked so out. we are now open. The Conductor's Cafe is now open. Well, we can't run around. So I'm taking my cousin Jeff to the cafe car. Oh, gosh. Walk slowly. We have these sit-down seats. And they also have open air cars like these. So we're passing by the lake. Is there a house? And these guys want the chicken biscuit. Hey, go! It's like Lake North. I'm sorry, man. This trash can is like keeping me from. The lake is dried up. Well, if we get thrown off the train, it's going to be your fault. engineer menu. So it's pretty reasonable. Yeah, everything on the train is pretty reasonable. Oh gosh. It's very shaky right now. I'm telling my friends I can't talk to I'm typing so I can't understand what I'm saying. It's like a ride. <laughs> okay, we're coming to the bump. Oh, look at the lake. 
Get some, yeah, get some napkins. And then call the guy was Hurry up. Oh, oh gosh, I mean, not gonna feeble. Oh gosh, just very bumpy. Samuel A. Spencer. We're on almond car. I think. has made it through this curve. Wow. What that means for you, if you don't have your train legs yet, great time to make your way to the Conductor's Cafe or to the restrooms. We'll be in this curve for a few minutes until our entire train makes it through the curve. Back in the southern days, back in the southern days, the speed on this curve was quite a bit faster as well as the track speed for the rest of our line. But they were hauling mostly freight, maybe one passenger car every now and then. So if we went much faster than this, none of us would probably enjoy that very much. This used to be a Southern Rollins Murphy branch. When we come out of this curve, on the left hand side, you'll see a boat dock with a large blue roof on it. The water level in the lake has dropped so much, they draw it down every year for maintenance on the dam, as well as any spring fall in the spring. Why did it take our entering, I think we're coming out of this tight curve. No, it says I'm on a train now. Oh. It actually says we're on a train instead of driving. <laughs> yeah, no one, I don't know the engineer, unfortunately. Oh, the water smells so good. Oh my goodness. And we're pretty... We're now in the Nantahala Gorge. And we're, I think we're close to the Outdoor Center. This row is US 74. Oh. Oh, that could, that's... We still have a few of those prepaid box lunches back here in the Conductor's Cafe. If you haven't picked them up already, go ahead and come get them. If they're not picked up by the end of our westbound trip, when we come to a stop, they will be oh. taken apart and sold to passengers who would like them. I'm just enjoying the smell of the water. Oh, 
I think that door opens me up. Oh, there's a bee on you. Oh, gosh. So we had to stop and now we're getting across. Wait, what number was I? I think I was that And then we have around 20 or 30 minutes till we get to the outdoor center. Or something. This is what you give me to work with. I smell something. There's like a little market. Oh, that's what I smell. I smell good. and personal. I ran through people. Wow. Cold tender. I missed him cutting it off. I guess he did that really quickly. Uh, there you go. Because right, Amiya ran up with me, which I don't know why. But she's a little crazy. But. It's so hot. Oh, I'm gonna get out of here before I sweat. Wow. Oh, gosh. Oh. The outdoor center, I ran ahead to get tip 202. I may have still complain about our service. Well, my friend, I don't know where they are. I'm not I have a text to my friend here. Oh my goodness, I'm getting hot. I want to walk across the bridge. It's down there. The, oh. They have lots of nice cross. So I want to walk across the bridge. Oh, that's nice. Oh, it's a fire pit. That is a huge pumpkin. Is that a real pumpkin? Wow. Yeah, right up against the water. Wow. Some of those are for like white water rafting. This river is pretty for it, as you can see. Oh, spider web. There are lots of spider webs here. Yeah, there's a restaurant here, and there's a restaurant there where we're gonna eat. We're not eating. We're gonna eat when we get back. It's the restaurant apparently is the Fall Folks Festival. 
That's a huge tank, by the way. And this is a food truck, but I suppose said very. I don't know what's going on with her. She's angry all the time. We're gonna find something to eat when we get back. But she feels nice here. Tooling Road here is US 74. Just stay a day and then go back to Florida. Yeah, we're like three hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's, we're going to the general store now, and I think we're walking back to the train. It's like a clothing store for like rafting and hiking, I guess. Also, it's like a little. This was like a gas station. The general store is basically a gas station. So we're gonna walk. Back across. <laughs> I know. Well, there was some, but I'm gonna wait till we get to get the stuff at the shops. I feel this is gonna be like a clothing store, but there's like an overlook here too. Walk around the motorcycles. <laughs> I'd get anything here. Oh, that's nice. I don't know what that's, what that's there. It's nine o'clock on a Saturday. Oh, you come up the trail. Huh. There are so many spiders in the street. Also, you could raft upstream. But alright. I mean, it's got an ice cream. Why oh, are you so zoomed in? It definitely has oh, areas where people hiking up on a trail can come in, replenish, get more supplies, and such like that. So this place is important for dirty. Now we're heading back to the train. This is some kind of like adventure. I said, you know, too, I made that. But we're still gonna ride. Oh gosh, why does this have a food? Not going to go. Mia, yeah, please. She wants to walk the train. Walk the train? Walk all the cars. I'm tired of bothering me about that. Do you like the horn? <laughs> oh, there's the lake again. I don't know what we're seeing here. Mia's sitting on the floor for some reason. Rocks. We never even saw this, but... There's 1702. Yep. 
Which is really good. The museum, I've heard, is a uh, top 10 museum here. Broward Museum. So that's good. I mean, look, there's kittens. There's kittens. So we're going to the Mount Sounds like my social studies teacher. Oh, I would want to get all of these. I would want the whole one. Oh my gosh. What? I got gotcha. I think this is a. Uh, they have different. Models. Yeah, H. I think this is Mount Trains. This one's only eighty-five dollars. Look at this one, only eighty-five dollars. I don't really know, but if I could afford this, I would. Uh, my mom got me a shirt I wanted to get shot. Hoping they have magnets in all these places. Uh, just waiting in the shade for 1702 to pull out. So, oh gosh, it's real wood. Okay, my shoulder is hurting. So, yeah, folks. These four flowers. Watch 1702 pull out. Uh, Oh, this is a part, the ice cream shop. Oh, this is cute. I got a chicken sandwich from the box. Okay, they will. <sighs> Definitely being a good man. They're in there. Okay, let's try this. Mm. Right. Okay, so we just had lunch and now we're gonna go do some shopping. Oh yeah. The loose moose. 
Oh, excuse me. Oh, You're fine. Yeah, we'll I'm okay. in here real quick. Yeah. I'm just gonna back and back. Okay. Not okay. City. It's a perfect shop. Yeah, I'm seeing what I saw in the two other stores. And some similarities to uh, West Jefferson, North Carolina. Although that's in the Blue Ridge Mountains in Nash County. There is no railroad tracks. There used to be. But this downtown and the mountains in the background are similar. Going to Appalachian Mercantile. Oh, that was so funny. This place sells like different honey sauces at a general store. More wood chimes. Oh. Now we're at the caboose. They're gonna recreate oh, a few years ago. So that, no, no. Now we're leaving. I didn't find anything in a shirt. I'm going to find something in Dillsboro. Going there, because apparently that's another place. I think we're heading back home. Oh, today, this is the next day. But we're redoing the house tour because the first one was in Dillsboro. Yeah, that was that. Let's come out and look at the beautiful view. It's scary. <laughs> Oh, well, there's a dog. So, uh, there was a dog that showed up at the front door and scared the heck of my, my Kathy. And now, uh, apparently they're coming to pick the dog up. I'm just sitting here in the balcony. This view is nice. See the mountains. This was crazy, but... Honestly, if I could pick a place to live and retire, I think I would choose up here. Small town life, in the mountains, trains, Boone, Bowling Rock, Nashville. Ah, oh, that would be so nice. I went over to where this dog came from. I scared you. Uh, no, this is a little extra adventure. I wasn't trip. scared by it. I was very. No. Well, I just didn't expect you to turn around and see a big dog sitting at the front door. Oh, no. I said dog. <laughs> well, this is a size of snowy. It's skinny. Yeah. Well, welcome here. Guilt and you can see what. Oh, good. We are walking up this trail. Oh, Jesus. Then that's why you should have plugged it in. Let's go. Yeah, that's a deadly one. Huh? That's a. If you eat that one, you'll die. Still going. <laughs> you found the mushroom. Like a woman. Oh! No. Like Mia. Yeah. Okay. We're heading over to the quaint town of Dillsboro to look around there. Have some Western Carolina barbecue, which. That's totally different one than I'm used to, because Western Carolina uses a tomato-based barbecue sauce, other than Eastern, which is more vinegary. We're here at Haywood Smokehouse, before I get run over by the Florida car. 
This place is like wood. Oh, goodness. Sorry. Oh, gosh, why did that scare me? Hopefully, there's not too long of a wait. Time is 30 to 45 minutes. Oh, this is nice. <laughs> I can go eat here all the time. Oh, this is it smells so good. The same key pictures we have at home. Kids. Kids on this side. Parental. Jeff is there. I don't know how to do it. Well, I can get Hey, I guess. Uh huh. Oh, here. But the sandwich. You don't have to fight over every single thing. So we just sat now. It smells good in here. Um, first, I'm sitting in between two legs. But yeah. There's the menu. Pork is green. The beans are pork. Oh, sorry. Okay, so we came back from Dillsboro. There wasn't really much to look around. There were old, old antique shops, but I'm heading back to the Shh. Oh, this dog's barking. We're heading back tomorrow morning to Bryce the City. I need to get something from the train shop. Actually, a few things. A cup, a magnet, and postcards. We're gonna roast some marshmallows, so yeah, we're gonna sit by the fire, roast some marshmallows. Do we have sticks for the marshmallows? Oh, okay, good. Oh gosh. the fire color. Maybe. I told her she's uh, very comfortable. Heard some <laughs> Oh no. I'm still going. 
And it's starting to sell around us. <coughs> and we leave tomorrow, but I have to sit this morning. It's the grill. Okay. All right, so I'm gonna take a shower. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing for the rest of the night. Just sit and watch the TV until everyone's tired. Oh gosh. And then three hour drive back home tomorrow. But it'll still film that for you guys. <sighs> that was a really good day. Uh, my next goal for train places is I have no idea. I wish we were going to Chattanooga, that's like three hours from here, so we're not doing that, unfortunately. But I'll see you guys later, maybe.